One cut. One cut's gonna make you bleed. But one cut don't kill you. One cut just makes a scar. We're gonna fucking fight him. A deeper cut. We're gonna fucking fight him. We're gonna get him. We're gonna... <laughs> makes you cry. But you can turn that cry into a roar, or you can turn it into a whimper. That's your choice. I can't take it. So you can choose to be a victim, no matter where you at. I can't take Top of the penthouse, in a prison cell, or even free. Roam in your own streets again. Complain about the cold, the rats. Complain about who's in charge. Some people want to stay the victim. They want to cry. I'll give you what you want. You want to be the victim? Well, I'll make you one. I'll make you one. Me? I'm going to take what's mine. They say this disease is a tragedy. They say it's the end of the world. Oh, yeah. This disease is our teacher. Oh, hell teaching yes. the uniforms that they done. Teaching us to rise up. They taken from us long enough. Now we take from them. They house us. Their cars. Their families. Their lives. This is our time. And now is our time. Oh, no, let me call it in. Dispatch is car 24. We have visual on unit 55. Looks abandoned over. Copy that over. Mother oh! Shit, they're behind us! We got it. Just go. Now, now! Dispatch, this is car 24. We are over. Car 24, what's going on Fuck. out there? Dispatch, this is car uh, 24. We are. Get, get back, 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 Soldiers of the Last Man Battalion, this is your commanding officer, Lieutenant Colonel Charles Bliss. There were those among us who were angry when the decision was made to leave us behind. Leave us to die, as some people said. But I looked around at this city, and I saw opportunity. I saw what it had been. And I saw what it could be once again if someone had the guts to fight for it. If there were men willing to go out in the streets and take them back from the degenerates and lowlifes who ruled them now, to do what the cowardly government and its fearful, weak soldiers were too afraid to do, and to cut down all the liars and murderers and thieves who stand in the way of peace, we will not look back. We will not compromise. We will do whatever it takes to ensure a better tomorrow for all those who stand with us. And those who stand against us, may God have mercy on their souls. Bliss out. Tell me we got that. Because God damn it, I'm not doing it a second time. I think we need to modify the terms of our agreement. Why, Colonel? It seems to be working perfectly well so far. You get the support of my people and their gear with field intel you couldn't dream of six weeks ago. I get a base of operations, a place on what's gonna be the winning side, and the occasional use of your manpower as needed. Not to mention the occasional surface-to-air missile. Or have you forgotten about that chopper in Brooklyn? Look, my people did the dirty work on that op bliss, and eliminating Senior command was as much a benefit to you as to me. 
Last thing either of us wanted was a senior division agent directing a second wave. Hang on, I'm getting feedback on the link. We've been compromised? Looks like. Cut in the link now. Now don't you... supposed to do that. Hang on a second. Look, we don't leave people behind. We're here to make sure this city doesn't get left behind. But the people we're working with, they're just fine with leaving all of us behind if it's convenient. Look, I don't agree with every decision that's been made, but I am saying it's time to leave them behind. Their model doesn't work anymore. If we're smart, we cut it loose before it drags us down. Before it kills us. You're talking treason. I'm talking common sense. Look around. There's nothing left to save. The JTF is trying to save a Manhattan that doesn't exist anymore. It is all about power now. Power and survival. They are done, but I am not. And you won't be either. Not if you work with me. I don't get it. You think there's maybe enough virus going around right now? It's all about the leverage. If I've got my hands on the dollar flu starter kit, this green poison that someone cooked up, then certain people are going to be a lot more reluctant to take a run at me. A gun's a lot better for self-defense than a weaponized virus. Stop thinking small. Start thinking possibilities. There's no medical infrastructure anymore. It's the Wild West out there, but less civilized. Being able to turn certain death loose at any time I want puts me in a powerful position. And controlling the core ingredients for a vaccine, that's useful too. So you might kill even more people. Who's gonna notice? It's not the killing. It's the threat of being able to kill. And giving them the hope they might be saved. The way things are breaking down out there, all these different groups carving their own territories out of what used to be civilization. It only makes sense to have an ace in the hole. <laughs> <laughs> 